Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to today's edition of Intuitive Angling. And man, I really appreciate each and every one of you guys coming by the channel and checking it out. Always uh, very grateful for that. And guys, today we're gonna be talking about, and I'm gonna show you the three lures that every pro in this country has in their box, but they don't talk about because most of them aren't sponsored by the company that makes it, but they're such incredible fish catchers that everybody has them in there. So we're gonna show you what that is. And uh, if there's three lures you probably need to have in your box, it's these three right here. Also guys, just a quick reminder, anyone interested in booking an on the water lesson with me, uh, you can do that by going to my Facebook page, Randy Block at Professional Angler, or just shoot me a message and I'll give you all the information for that. So much appreciated. Okay guys, here's the deal on this. There's throughout, um, oh, ever since I've been bass fishing, there's always been a handful of lures that the pros use and they don't talk about. Now, there's a couple different reasons for that. Some, some of the times it's about because they don't want to give it up. It's so good that they don't want to like, you know, have a bunch of people know about it, or it can be a situation where an angler is sponsored by a different company um, and they don't want to like, you know, show other lures besides the company they're sponsored by. That's the two reasons that you don't see pros talking about a lure for the most part. But one of the things that I've found that sort of changed a lot, that's the way it used to be up until a few years ago. But now since, you know, there's so much live coverage in tournaments, um, there's no hiding it. So there's no reason to try to hide it. And on top of that, I have found that, that most anglers are smart in the fact that they know if they're being like, um, if they know if they're being, being fed a line of BS, because it used to be, especially back in the nineties and early two thousands, that um, if a pro did good in a tournament, they would say they caught them on their sponsor lure 100% of the time when you know that they didn't. And now pros are more um, accepting and more willing to say what they caught them on, even if it isn't a uh, sponsored lure that they're associated with, because that lends credibility to the angler. And in return, the companies that sponsor those anglers, they want to have anglers that are known to have credibility. So um, from a sponsorship standpoint or whatever, if somebody is sponsored by say a plastic worm company and they, they happen to catch them on another brand of plastic worm, that doesn't take anything away from that company's sponsorship of that angler there. It lends credibility to that angler because he's still promoting the brand every time he can. He just happened to catch them in that one tournament on a different product out there. So that's sort of a good thing, but there are three lures that I wanna talk about here that every pro out there has in their boat, unless they're a 25 year old uh, live scoper that, um, that doesn't use anything but little minnow baits out there. That there is, you know, part of that out there. Okay, let's talk about the first one, guys. This is the one, this is probably the most obvious one, is the Mega Bass Vision 110 series jerk bait. Uh, this is the 110 plus one. Guys, this has been in every single, every, I don't mean 99.9%, Every pro angler over the past 20 years has got one of these in their boat simply because it is the best jerk bait, arguably, without a doubt, it, on the planet. There's no doubt. This is this thing, the attention to detail, the components in it, everything about it, it generates more strikes than any other jerk bait. There's been a ton of companies out there that have tried to copy it a little bit and tried to compete with the Mega Bass Vision 110 series but you can't do it. This is like the original. This is the one that I helped design back in the late nineties. Every pro's got this in their box, even if they're not talking about it. Next one guys is the Jack Hammer bladed jig here. Now there's a bunch of bladed jigs on the market. Um, the Jack Hammer is in every pro's box out there. Now I use the Jack Hammer and I use the original Chatterbait. I use another bladed jig called the Earth Shaker. I use several different ones but the jackhammer is in every pro's boat. And the, the reason for this, it's not necessarily that the vibration or whatever catches more fish. The, the thing that makes the jackhammer superior is the components in this thing are high quality. You got a really, really good hook in this thing. It's super sharp, it's small diameter, it's a perfect bite gap. You've got like one of the best keepers I've ever seen in my life here to keep your soft plastics on there. Um, you got its hand tied skirt, which is really good. You know, you got a chip resistant, you know, a lot of different colored heads and it just catches fish. I mean, there's, it's in every single pro's boat out there. And finally guys, another mega bass lure that every pro has and doesn't talk about is the mega bass six inch mag draft and the, even some of the bigger size. Make no mistake about it guys. This is the best swim bait in this, in the country, in the world right now. This thing will catch you more fish 
in terms of a swim bait that's sort of like that medium, larger size swim bait than anything out there. It's got this head, the head when you reel it through the water, the, the front of the head sort of wiggles like that. And you got this big waggling tail, just the whole profile, the hook harness. Again, this is another bait that's been highly copied by a bunch of other companies out there, but this is the original, the Megabass Magdraft. This thing is in the box of every pro out there. So anyway, guys, I'd highly suggest it. Um, I'll put my Tackle Warehouse link in the description. If you guys want to order these baits through Tackle Warehouse, I'll link them in the description. You can guys could use that link. It's a good way to help the channel out. And um, there's a reason why they all have them in their boat, man. You guys should too. I've got them all in my boat. And um, for traditional bass fishing and even for spotlighting, because Mega Bass Jerk Bait is one of the top spotlighting baits out there, um, there are three baits that you definitely want to have in your box. So hope it helps out guys. We'll talk later.